I want to share with you our top five best free invoice and billing software tools. And uh, so if you're interested in this topic, here's a review I want you to pay attention to. Number five, you have Invoicely, our score, 8.5 over 10. So when you think about Invoicely, I want you to think about a tool that's great for small and micro businesses, also um, medium-sized businesses as well. And especially if you are in the e-commerce niche, you will love Invoicely very, like a really, really greatly. And what we love about Invoicely here is that you basically have a, a software tool that offers uh, more capabilities and functionalities than others on the market right now. And the cool thing is that you are able to have an easy to use interface and low cost the paid plans that range from uh, $8 all the way to $25 with annual billing or $10 all the way to 30 bucks with monthly billing. So it's always better to actually go with, uh, with the, with the, um, with the um, annual billing. That way you save like close to 25%. And with its uh, free plan, Invoicely can actually help you get up to uh, five invoices per month and save up to three clients in your account. So this is uh, without you paying anything. And you can also send payment reminders with the free plan, but you have to do so manually. So basically, we have an element of uh, ma manual intervention here. If you're comfortable with that, you're good to go. And additionally, you can accept payments online via PayPal. But if you want other payment options for clients, you have to upgrade to a paid plan. And the paid plans do give you useful features such as payment receipts, automatic payment reminders, and quotes or estimates. But again, Invoicely remain, remains a, a great free invoice and billing software tool for you to use, not a problem. So let's talk about the pros and cons real, real fast here. The pros first, you have a free plan. You're able to send payment reminders. You can take partial payments. You can track expenses, and uh, but you are limited to five invoices per month on the free plan, okay? Five invoices. And uh, what about the cons here that you have to be aware of? You can only use PayPal on the free plan. If you're comfortable with that, you are good to go. No payment receipts are available on the free plan. And uh, this tool actually requires the paid plan for automatic payment reminders. And uh, there is no, there are no quotes on the free plan. But overall, this is a great tool uh, if you want a, a great free invoice and billing software that really adapts to uh, your e-commerce niche. Boss, welcome back to the show. It's really a pleasure to have you here. Make yourself comfortable. You are going to enjoy today's conversation. Number four, you have Hivage, our score. 8.8 over 10. So Hivage is kind of cool if you are a gig, gig economy entrepreneur, if you are new, uh, no business if you're a startup if you're an established business they actually cover they actually cover the whole nine yards what we love about Havage here is that you basically can can really uh, enjoy their free plan but there is a maximum of five clients per account one user per account recurring invoices and customizations okay and uh, so the Havage offers a free invoicing software plan that is as that that is the basic billing solution so that you can send an unlimited number of invoices to a small number of clients okay Additionally, you can you can send unlimited estimates and track time and expenses also. So this element of uh, time tracking is is really uh, welcome when when we think about Havage and Havage Havage's free plan is a bit more in our view a bit more limited than other free invoices uh, other free invoicing software tools. But if you don't need other features, if you're really cool with a uh, bare bones uh, tool, then uh, Havage is a great pick for you. And on this on this uh, tool, you actually can send up uh, you can set up multiple payment gateways to give your clients different ways to pay, such as with PayPal, bank transfer, or online payments with a credit card, okay? And uh, if you think you need more features, you can sign up for a free trial or to test out Havage's uh, other plans, which range in price from 20 bucks all the way to 50 bucks per month with a discount for annual billing. So we, we love that a lot. And so the, the thing is, in our view, Havage is kind of cool for those who have a sad gig or a brand new company and uh, so because if you are in that situation you may not have as many billing feature needs as more established businesses and would do really well with having just simple invoicing software so what are the pros and cons here so pros first you, know, you have a free plan is available you have unlimited estimates and invoices you have time tracking it's uh, that feature is included and you can track expenses for your business what about the cons here? Well, the free and basic plans are limited to one user per account. Only five clients are allowed on the, on the free plan and no payment reminders are available on the, on, the, uh, on the free plan also. 
Well, so I want to quickly remind you of today's topic. We are having a conversation about uh, the best free invoice and billing software tools. Number three, you have Invoice Ninja, our score. Nine over 10. So when you think about Invoice Ninja, I want you to think about a, a tool that's great for entrepreneurs with multiple businesses. So if you are a serial entrepreneur, you will love this uh, this tool. Uh, this, this is a fantastic tool, okay? And one thing I want to say here is that Invoice Ninja remains a feature-packed free invoice invoicing software that makes it very easy for you to manage billing for multiple clients and even multiple businesses. And you can create an unlimited number of quotes and invoices but the free plan limits you to uh, to 50 clients. And the cool thing is you can add a logo to invoices to add professionalism, but you are stuck with the Invoice Ninja branding too. So it's one of those things where if you're comfortable with the Invoice Ninja branding, well, you know, you can go ahead and not a problem. But if you if for any reason you don't like it, it's just better to upgrade. And uh, so one thing I want to say here is that uh, a unique feature of Invoice Ninja is that it basically allows you to send invoices for multiple businesses so that you know you can manage billing for all your businesses or clients businesses with one free account okay as with most of the free of the best free invoicing software invoice ninja lets you use payment gateways such as we pay stripe authorized net authorized.net and paypal and uh, so if you find the limitations of the free plan too restrictive you can really you can always upgrade to one of the paid plans which are affordable at uh, 10 bucks all the way to 14 to 15 bucks per month and the paid plans also include payment reminders, reporting, and a branded URL so that customers can pay via a link. So this is this is always great, by the way. And so it, when we analyze uh, Invoice Ninja, we think it's a great choice for any small to mid-sized business, but it's best for individuals also who run multiple companies. We're talking about serial, serial entrepreneurs and who need to invoice for each one. You can actually do so up to... Uh, 10 businesses from one account. So this is kind of cool in terms of flexibility. What are the pros and cons here? Well, the pros, the free plans available, unlimited invoices and quotes. You can add logos to invoices. You, you have inventory management. You have a, a client portal. So there is a client portal available and uh, this tool supports multiple businesses. What about the cons here? Well, there is a free plan display uh, displays actually uh, like invoice uh, ninjas in the invoice, the invoice ninjas branding. No payment reminders on the free plan, only 50 clients allowed on the free plan. Next, I want to talk to you about Zoho invoices. Our score 9.6 over 10. When you analyze Zoho invoices, I want you to really invoice rather Zoho invoice. I want you to think about a tool that's great for freelancers and solopreneurs. Okay, so if you're listening to me right now and you are in that category, you will love uh, you will love Zoho uh, for 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 their work. One thing I want to say here is that you have to really understand that uh, it's it's totally up to you in terms of uh, in terms of all the things you want to uh, really do. It's one of those things where you have to be comfortable with uh, with uh, like with the work that you're doing in terms of. Uh, in terms of uh, getting things right. Okay, let me just put it that way. So when you think about Zoho Invoice, I want you to think about, first of all, Zoho is part of uh, the Zoho ecosystem. Everybody knows Zoho. They have uh, Zoho Books. They have uh, Zoho uh, Marketing. They have uh, Zoho Sales. They have a lot of things. And uh, so Zoho Invoice is one of the best free invoice software options because there are no hidden fees. And uh, you, you'll have to pay for any transaction fees when clients pay an invoice, okay? And Zoho Invoice lets you connect to some of the biggest payment gateways such as authorized.net stripe braintree and ach payment you can you can also use paypal so this is kind of cool and you can use zoho invoice to track your projects including billable hours and, and convert estimates and projects into invoices and you can send invoices by email or let clients log into a portal where they can view and approve estimates and pay invoices you can also set up automatic payment reminders, which can help you get paid on time because you want to get paid on time. Or, you know, this is kind of important. So it's important to keep in mind the limitations of a Zoho invoice. While it is a powerful free billing solution, only one user is allowed per account and you are limited to five clients. 
Also, you can only send up to 1,000 invoices per year. So, I mean, if you are like a, if you are a solopreneur, if you're a freelancer and you don't have that many clients, Zoho could, could, could actually be a great uh, tool for you. And uh, so, uh, so the limitations of Zoho invoices, free invoicing software may be too strict for a growing business, but it is an ideal pick in our view for a freelancer who has a handful of clients but sends regular invoices, okay? So what are the pros and cons of this tool here? Well, the pros first, you have free software. There are no hidden fees. You're able to connect to top payment processors. This includes uh, actually project management. This includes a project management tool and you can turn quotes and projects into invoices. What about the cons here? Well, you are limited to 1,000 invoices per year and only one, one to three users are allowed per account. Plus, I want to quickly remind you of today's topic. We are having a conversation about our top five best free invoice and billing software tools. Number one, the best of the best. We have Square Invoices, our score. 9.8 over 10. So when you think about Square Invoices, I want you to think about a great tool. It's totally free. So the free plan from Square Invoices is a great option for almost any business that uses invoices to build clients. It's a versatile invoicing software that lets you collect payment in person using Square's mobile app and card reader online or via ACH. So we're talking about automated clearinghouse bank transfer payments. So to ensure you get paid on time, you can set up automatic payment reminders with each invoice. You can stick with the default schedule one day and three days after the due date or send customized reminders. If you need to send uh, custom invoices or you want to track projects, you will have to upgrade Square invoices to the paid plan, which costs about 20 bucks per month, okay? And with the paid plan, you will also be able to save time with, a, with the ability to save invoice templates and get paid at specific intervals during a longer project with uh, milestone-based uh, payments. So this is kind of cool. And now, regardless of which plan you choose, the 2.6% to 3.5% transaction fee plus 10 cents to 30 cents is the same. So they don't change, they don't really change anything there. So in our view, for all intents and purposes, Square Invoices is an excellent choice for any small business that needs free invoicing software. You can basically accept payments online or in person, and Square offers integrations that are useful for online service and brick and mortar businesses. So what are the pros and cons of, 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 of Square invoices here? Well, the pros first, you have unlimited estimates, invoices and clients, users. You can accept uh, online ACH and in-person payments. You, you have a built-in customer portal. You have inventory and time tracking integrations. You know, the, here, the, the, this tool uses Square payment processing and you can send payments reminders to clients, not a problem. What about the cons here? Well. Customization, project tracking, and auto conversion are actually are needed on the on the paid plan. And so you can't do it on the free plan. So those were the five the five best free invoicing and billing, billing software. Now let me give you an overview of the whole conversation here. So when we talk about um, the best free invoicing software you need to actually look at a, a certain features that really are present in those uh, in those software but you also need to have a clear idea about your own needs so you have a business and you basically have needs right and you got to have a clear idea about what really matters to your to your business the, the thing here is that um, most invoicing software includes base software features such as the ability to send invoices and receive payments and there are many other features that uh, the top invoicing software offers to make it easier for you to track payments, contact clients, and manage inventory and finances, okay? Now, when we talk about the, the top invoicing software features, we're talking about inventory tracking. We're talking about client portal. We're talking about time tracking. We're talking about a mobile app. We're talking about analytics. We're talking about integrations. So this is kind of important to really keep in mind. You always have to keep that in mind. So we're talking about uh, all kinds of stuff that really are great in terms of uh, making sure, in terms of giving you the ability to get things done properly. So again, I want to mention the fact that inventory tracking is really important because uh, you want to uh, keep accurate stock counts. This is vital for businesses that sell physical products, for instance, 
and uh, it can still be a viable feature for service-based businesses. And uh, most businesses that use invoicing software track inventory in a separate application. So if you choose, let's say if you choose invoicing software that includes even inventory tracking, you can consolidate a bit and you want to have a client portal. Although um, most invoicing software gives you the ability to send invoices to your clients, a portal for your clients can be even more helpful than an email. Think about it. So a client portal makes it possible for your clients to log into the software to see the progress you are making on projects and estimates along with the past, current, or upcoming invoices. And what about time tracking? Well, it, this is kind of cool. This is kind of important also. And service-based businesses rely on time tracking tools to keep a, a running tab on uh, billable and non-billable hours to use for invoicing. So when time tracking is included as a feature in your invoicing software, it can be a huge help. You can instantly turn billable hours into the amount your client owes and send the invoice. Otherwise, you are stuck doing work in separate software. Okay, and you also have a mobile app. So having a mobile app for invoicing is really cool. Also, this can be a convenient tool. If you often work away from your desk, you can send invoices and payment reminders easily from your phone or tablet anywhere you, you are as long as you have an internet connection. If you, if you actually prefer uh, using push notifications, some invoicing mobile apps let you know when a payment goes through so you don't have to keep checking your payment apps or email. So in terms of flexibility, this is really cool. So how do you actually choose invoicing software here? The thing here is that when we talk about choosing invoicing software, there are a few, there are a few, there are a few, a few criteria for you to pay attention to. First of all, it really depends on what you really, uh, what what your vision is, okay? Because you want to pay attention to uh, the pricing, so you want to look at things like free plans, for instance. You want to look at things like free trials, for instance, and uh, you want to have unlimited invoices as well as integrations. So if you are a budget conscious business, you want to look at those four things. So that quartet here, free plans, free trials, unlimited invoices, and integrations. And a free plan may be limited in how you can customize it or the number of invoices you can send. This, this may actually suit a solopreneur best. And in terms of free trials, many software companies will let you try their full software for a limited time. So this trial period will give you an idea of what you need and what you can live without which will help you narrow your search even more. In terms of unlimited invoices, if invoicing software allows you unlimited invoice sends for free, you may have to accept that your invoices will, will have the company's branding on them. So if you're comfortable with that, which is not really uh, the, the right way to go, but if you're comfortable with that, you can actually uh, enjoy the free benefits that come with that free software. And you also have integrations now. Typically, free invoicing software is going to have limitations or lack of features. So you want to choose one that offers the integrations you need at a minimum, you should be able to connect the payment. You should be able to connect to payment processors and accounting software. Now, you you can all, always go through uh, Zapier to sort of have have those integrations. And so, if you're looking for a, a feature-rich invoicing software tool, look at things like automation, tracking, customization, and processing discount. A software tool that allows you to actually uh, process discounts. Okay, and so automation is really good because you are turning estimates or billable hours into invoices automatically. And this is especially helpful for businesses that offer subscriptions or have long-term clients that expect recurring invoices. This is a time-saving feature that you can find in most paid plans, even some low-tier plans. What about tracking? Well, depending on the software or plan that you choose, you can track expenses, receipts, inventory, or vendors. It's one of those features that may be worth paying for if you don't have inventory tracking software already. Customization is kind of cool too, and, and as are processing discounts, okay? And so if you're looking for an all-in-one business apps, you you want to go for apps that really has that really have invoicing, CRM, project management, time tracking, inventory management, human resources, marketing, invoicing, accounting, reporting, messaging, expenses. So you can have an all-in-one sort of uh, all-in-one all -in option. And uh, you also have a la carte options in terms of uh, you choosing your invoice and billing software.
Boss, before I close to this conversation, I want to acquaint you with our, our invoice and billing software evaluation approach. I want you to look on the screen right now so you have a clear idea about our approach when it comes to evaluating, categorizing, and listing invoice and billing software. Please check this out right now. All right, let's quickly recap here. Number one, we have Square Invoices, our score 9.8 over 10. Number two, you have you have Zoho Invoice, our score 9.6 over 10. Number three, you have Invoice Ninja, our score 9 over 10. Number four, you have Hivage, our score 8.8 over 10. And number nine, number number five rather, number five, we have Invoice Late, our score 8.5 over 10. Thank you so much for your attention. I really appreciate it. God bless you. I'll see you next time. Until then, remember, stay marvelous.